Hi everyone, Dr. Mike here. Let's quickly talk about blood pH. Now your blood has a number of different components dissolved within it. Some of these components are charged atoms or elements, such as sodium, potassium, and hydrogen. You can see they have a particular charge which makes them something called an ion. So sodium ion, potassium ion, hydrogen ion. And their concentration within the blood is around about for sodium 140 millimolar, for potassium around 3.5 millimolar, and for hydrogen it's around about 0.00004 millimolar. Now don't worry too much about the unit, it's just another measurement, such as microliters or millimeters for example, it's just a unit of concentration. Now what you can see here is that the hydrogen ion concentration is extremely low. When you get a blood reading, okay, so blood measurement, you're going to have these concentrations pop up. They're easy to write, but this number is too small, too many zeros to put down on a piece of paper, too many mistakes can be made with the more zeros present. So this isn't the way we want to write something down. Now, sometimes we need to put these in molar form. So for example, the molar form of sodium is 0.14, for potassium ion, 0.0035, and look how small the molar concentration is of hydrogen being zero point then seven zeros and a four. Okay, this is where pH comes into play because in all honesty, pH is simply the measurement of hydrogen ion concentration within the blood. It's just another way of writing 0 0.00004 millimolar. Let's take a look. If you were to get your calculator out and you were to write down this number here, zero point, then put the four sevens and write the log of it, so if you write the log of hydrogen ion concentration, pop it in your calculator, what you end up getting as a readout would be negative 7.4. Now, you do not want to write down on a chart negative 7.4. You don't want to write out for a concentration negative because it's an imaginary number. So we need to get rid of that negative. Easy. You make it the negative log. So if you write the negative log of hydrogen ion concentration, it ends up being 7.4. But you don't want to write on a chart as the unit of measurement, negative log, hydrogen ion concentration. The negative log is the same as writing the power of, the power of something. So the power of hydrogen ion concentration is 7.4. And we can shorten this, we can get rid of that, and we can get rid of those brackets, and we can simply write it as pH. And the pH of blood is 7.4. The pH stands for the power of hydrogen ion. So the concentration of hydrogen ions in your blood is 7.4.